Hello, I'm Pedro Escobar from the University of Vienna and my collaborators are uh, Francesco Mascia and Gianluigi Bacchetta from the University of uh, Cagliari in Italy, in Sardinia. And uh, I would like to present a poster about uh, Lavatera trilova, subspecies palestans. Uh, this is a, a, a nice story about uh, how a Mediterranean taxon that was uh, supposed to be extinct or, or was also misinterpreted came back. Uh, the story is that uh, Lavatera trilova subspecies palestans was described in Sardinia in the, in the middle part of the 19th century. And uh, well, then the name was applied also to some plants that were found in Menorca, right here. So the plant was described here in Sardinia, and then the name was applied also to plants from Menorca. But the, the plant from Sardinia was never found again. The last time that somebody saw this plant alive was in 1998 and since then nobody collected the plant. And then what happened is that uh, me and my colleagues, well, we had interest in this, uh, in this subspecies and we decided to, to, well, let's go to the field and look for the plant. And we had a, a lot of good luck and we found a population. Then the next year we went again and we found two additional populations. And what we, what we found is, is is that uh, the plant is actually very different than what there is in, in Menorca and uh, the, the name was used to name the plants from Menorca but it should actually not be so. You can see here the differences. This is the plant that we found in Sardinia which is a very showy outcrosser and this is the plant from Menorca which is inbreeding. This is a very tiny plant, it's up to 40 centimeters high and this is actually a, a big plant normally more than one meter and reaching one meter fifty and there are also some major differences in the type of, of indumentum that you can see here uh, this small thing has this indumentum with estelate hairs and this the, the, the plant that we found in Sardinia has a trimorphic indumentum with estelate hairs and also with simple hairs, glandular hairs and, and, and so on. Ecologically they are also quite different. The plant from Minorca is subruderal, the plant from Sardinia is appearing only in primary habitats very close to the sea, uh, exposed to the to the well to the breeze of the sea. Well, this other plant is actually sensitive to, to salt. And well, uh, maybe nobody found the plant before because the habitat is a bit difficult to, to locate. You can see here where the plant is growing, actually. <laughs> we found a population here in these crevices, but the, the plants are growing always in, in these very, very inaccessible limestone peaks. They are, this place is, is very well known for, for, it's a very wonderful landscape in Sardinia, but uh, I think that uh, little people get to there to, to pick up plants. And uh, well, the rest of the post is just a comparison with other taxa that can be found in other areas of the Western Mediterranean. This is Lavatera flava, which is found in North of Africa. Uh, this is, uh, no sorry, this is Agri Lavatera grigentina <laughs> that is found in Sicily. This is Lavatera flava with an array of different forms which is found in the, in the north of Africa. This is the, the taxon that, that, that we dis rediscovered in, in Sardinia, here. This is the, the small taxon from, from Menorca that is renamed here. And this is the type of subspecies, uh, Lavatera trilova subspecies trilova that occurs in the, in the Iberian Peninsula and also some populations in Sardinia, but they are not intermixing. We have also some molecular dat data, some F AFLP data and they are really genetically distinct and they are not crossing with, with each other. And I think that with this I'm finishing. Thank you. <laughs>